a hotel gym here at the Hudson Hotel in uh, New York at 58th Street. As you can see, it's very simple. It's got cardio machines and uh, some machines here. But glad they have the Smith machine and also a few dumbbells right here. So I'll be using that for, uh, for my shoulder lateral flies, a few shoulder work. So it's a tough shoulder workout on this day. Had a couple of drinks the night before. And so it really hit me hard. Felt it on my muscles. Felt the soreness and uh, definitely felt the weakness in my strength. And I had 25 pound plates there, which was a little heavy for me. But I'm glad they had a Smith machine because they didn't have the squat bar. Yeah, I'm here at the hotel gym um, because I'm, I'm staying here over the weekend, doing some celebration with friends. And um, last night I had a couple of drinks. I don't drink a lot at all, but you know, I've been social a little bit and I had a couple of Prosecco, that's like sparkling white wine, if you guys don't know. And uh, it's my preferably choice of drink when I go out or when I socialize because it's the only thing I can really handle. And I'll probably have some more Prosecco tonight. It does affect my workout. I'm a little sore and a little more tired and I'm a little more drier whenever I drink my skin gets really dry and that's when the aging process begins so I I try to, to avoid drink. I don't really like drinking anyway to tell the truth um, but I'll do it on social occasions such as this weekend anyway that's it and I'm gonna continue again I'm glad they had the Smith machine because uh, I normally use the bar for overhead presses and also for the seated overhead so it helped that it had even a uh, Smith machine or the hotel gym it was a good workout though, it was initially empty and then uh, people started coming in afterwards. So I was a bit dehydrated too. When I drink, I tend to be dehydrated throughout the, the next day and even the day after. And also really hungry, I get like the biggest munchies um, when I drink a little bit. But yeah, even my lateral flies was really rough. I didn't film all my workouts. I did also the cable lateral flies and some ab work and 10 minutes of hit at the end of my workout. All right, so I just finished 10 sets of dumbbell lateral flies, and now I'm off to do some five sets of rear delt flies. And after that, a few more shoulder workouts. And see what happens. Oh, these 20 pounds are heavy. easy for me if I didn't drink uh, alcohol but my body is not handling it very well at all all right so I finished my rear flies I'm off to do the dumbbell front raises and uh, because I'm weak today I'm starting with only 10 pounds as my warm-up and then move on to 15 pounds so that's what I'll do do five sets of this Stop talking um, when people started coming in the gym. But worked on these Arnold presses for five sets, and then the rest of my workout. So, 
we're here at the lounge area. My friend Annie. Hi. And, uh, I have my nails done. That's why I took. Oh, nice. <laughs> We're gonna go to the other bar called the uh, library bar here. It's pretty cool. Check out this reception area. Yeah. So Yeah, there was a wedding here yesterday. Oh, this is nice. This is a nice area. This is a outside garden. They have a rooftop that's open tomorrow, starting May. This is the library room. The library bar. We have some drinks here. Sue's coming after 7. Okay. And, uh, all right. So I got my uh, Prosecco here waiting for friends. And that's my first drink. And this is the library room. Really cool um, bar, really cool hotel. If you guys are ever in New York, I highly recommend this place. It's called the Hudson New York or something. Hudson Bar Hotel. Hudson Bar Hotel. The Hudson Hotel at 58th Street, a Hell's Kitchen. And it's, it's an awesome hotel. Reminds me of South Beach <laughs> at night, you know, there's a lot of parties here. We're celebrating life. That's what we're celebrating life, man. All right, see you guys again next time. Thanks for watching.